We're averaging about 800 people here a day. Uh, we have three locations across the county that you can vote at and 10 that you can return your ballot at. Uh, we're seeing about 3,000 people a day between all these locations. On a sunny afternoon in St. Paul, early voters arrive at this elections office to either return their mail-in ballot. If you're doing drop off, step to the left line. If you're voting in person, stand in this middle line. Or vote in person. Very painless. painless. Ramsey County Elections Manager David Triplett says though the most obvious changes are the safety guidelines, the most dramatic change is the 3,000% increase in voting by mail. Vote by mail has always been an option in Minnesota for at least the last 100 years, uh, but a few years ago the legislature removed uh, having to have an excuse to do that. Uh, and ever since that excuse has been removed, uh, we have seen a dramatic increase every year of vote by mail. Uh, the pandemic has only accelerated that trend that we'd already seen. Voters have three options, voting on election day at their polling place, in person beginning 46 days before an election in Ramsey County, or by mail. Triplett says more people are dropping off their mail ballots in person than previous elections. I think voters just want to make sure their vote is counted, and the best way to do that is to drop it off here in person, and that's why we've provided 10 locations. Triplett says it's important for people to return their mail-in ballots as quickly as possible. If there's an error, you want enough time to correct it. You can track your ballot online at mnvotes.org. Well, I'm getting a lot of questions. Uh, are you ready for this big election? And we are. I want to let everybody in Ramsey County know if you want to vote, we've got a ballot here waiting for you. Uh, whether you want to vote in person on Election Day, in person before Election Day, or through the mail, we've got a ballot here waiting for you.